Today we'll be doing quick car if you want either one of these Hot Wheels Buzzerks. That is the Premier Edition, that's the 2015 edition. So today I do not really feel like unboxing my Premier Edition of the Buzzerk. Um, but we will be unboxing this 2015 Medieval Rides Buzzer. The reason I want to crack this one is because it's got that buzz saw in the middle. And I'm wondering if when it rolls it spins. So I think we should crack this now. Pretty excited. I'm not sure what it's going to be like. Oh, oh, that was a pretty bad opening, actually. You can see, it is a part of the medieval ride segment, and there's the showdown code if you want it. So here is the buzzer. So it's a very cool looking car. As you can see, it's got the buzzer in the middle, and it does spin. And we can wait till for the moment of truth when we'll see if it does spin when you roll it on the track. As you can see, it does have some two pipes on the edge and he's got this like metal handle sort of thing. So that would make it kind of heavy. So there's the pipes on the side. It's got open hole five spokes, one of my favorite wheels. As you can see there, it's got a nice green um, colors. I don't know how this is medieval, but I like the car. So on closer inspection, as you can see, you've kind of got like a shield there with the Hot Wheels logo there. So as you can see, the base code is G32, so that is actually a 2014 release car. So that means it's the 23rd week of um, 2014. As you can see, it's got the track star logo there. I wouldn't pick this car to be a track star. And it does not say when this casting was first introduced, but I do know it is 2011, because I do own the first edition. This is the moment of truth. I'm dying to know this ever since I found out about this car. Ready, set. Go. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. No, it doesn't roll. On closer inspection, when you roll it on this carpet here, it seems to spin. It might just be like the depth of the surface. Sadly, I think I might actually have to give this car a six out of 10, just because this does not actually work well on the track. And it is kind of an ugly looking car when it's by itself. Is that what happens when I give you a bad score? Come on, Buzzerk. Anyway, check out my channel for more content like this. Like and subscribe. Bye for now.